Hey folks, Zoomy Gaming here, back with some Farnham's Legacy. So I did record an episode, but I decided not to record any game audio and any microphone. So I'm going to have to record another one. Uh, it's no harm done. So, um, in between episodes, I did a bit of um, diplomacy. If you go into diplomacy and... Acquire special ships. Once they complete, you have the opportunity to go in and buy a ship from whatever shipyard you um, did this on. Um, you do still need the reputation. So whenever you do it the first time, you can buy an M4. Uh, if you do it again, you can buy an M3. Then, at least in the split, that is the first time it's at M4, the second time it's at M3. Um, I bought the M3, which is, or was, the, probably in the process of being reverse engineered. But basically, it's an advanced Mamba. Um, and then there's the ship I'm in, which is the Acronox prototype. I have noticed it flying around. I'm, very, I'm, I'm, I'm sure I've looked at it at least once before. Um, it is this one. I have spent some time, which I actually spent in last episode, that is now a lost episode, um, getting the shields, getting the guns. I'm missing one concussion impulse generator. Um, it has six ion shard real guns at the minute, five concussion impulse generators, and then six turrets. Um, up, down, and back are mass drivers, and it seems to be working pretty well. Hey, excuse me. Um, it's not the fastest of ships, it's 190 meters per second, but it's fast enough to do what we need it to do. What's your problem? I don't know what you're complaining about, but Space Lab Headquarters. You're complaining about something. Uh anywho. Yes. This is the ship, the M6 you can buy from Split after doing it three times. Um it cost forty million credits. So it's a bit of a setback. And at the minute what I want to do is show off its military capabilities. So it's got 600 mega, 600,000 megajoules of shielding. Um, In each of the ion shard rail guns takes ten thousand shield damage. You are talking information you require pirates. I don't want to fight pirates. Oh, another thing is um there is stuff happening. Uh yeah. I'm sorry, I'm recording this at half one in the morning, um, so I'm a bit tired. So there's the advanced Mamba. Um, oh, and I also accidentally bought a blueprint for 4.2 million. I'm fairly sure it's an M3. I don't know what blueprint it was. I was doing my standard, you know the way I sometimes accidentally buy sector maps? Yeah, I did that with a blueprint. Um, I'm fairly sure it's one of the M3s at 4.2 million. It might be the Perseus Vanguard, might be a Paracud Raider, might be the Falcon Hauler. I honestly can't remember what I haven't got or what it what I have or had. And you know, what's new. So if there's anything you saw there. That is new. Okay, let, let's take this and hope that they don't jump in behind me. Um, 600,000. 
think we only need to do is kill one ship. It's not you. Oh, my thumbnail will be from the previous episode as well. Um. Oh, hey, this ship. This ship can launch. I've colored a green. I'm tempted just to go with a blue. Um, because it just looks too much like boron. Not that I don't like boron, I just don't like boron in this pile because they seem to just have a knack for hitting me for no apparent reason. Um, Xenon N. I'll try and help you, little fishy. So, unfortunately, with this ship, it's not got a great choice of guns. Um, in the sense that uh, it can like equip your yeah, on shot real gun, the compulsion impulse generator. Um, mass drivers, which I've put, you know, all around it. Come on, hit the. F there we go. Um, Teladi rapid response condor. Xenon N. Xenon N. Let's try the concussion impulse generators. L. Ooh, an L. Xenon N. Yeah, it's not got much, it's not got any options really for. You know, this, these little speedy fucks. Oh, speaking of fucks. Um, oh, and these guy, this guy can equip them. Um, look at the shield sets. I think he can have 400 megajoules of shield in. How many does he have? And he had maximum shielding. Uh oh. Oops. Um. Yeah, this ship can launch boarding pods, so the likes of these guys can get. They don't have to spacewalk, basically. Um. Argon recon. Um. I don't know what I'm trying to pick up here. Cargo bay now contains yeah, missile. What are you? Remote out of help. Oh, missile. Cargo bay now so yeah. Missile. Um. You are talking to the board. I would. You are talking. Well, please choose a reward on which to spend the points. For scorpion prototype. Laddy Mobile Drilling System Factory. And some other stuff that's not important. You are talking to you. I shall transmit the data. He's selling a vulture for too much. Remote guided warhead. I always like the remote guided warheads. So yeah, what I want to do is I want to take Wildfire missile. Teladi rapid response. Condor. Um. 
mosquito missile. That's no, hardly worth it. There you are. Banshee missile. Yes, so I want to go and get the boarding pods. Cargo bay now contains Banshee missile. And then because there's that centaur. It is floating about somewhere. It's still hostile to me and doesn't seem to be moving at all. Cargo, cargo bay now there we go. So am I still on this mission? Missile. Yeah, I'm still on this mission. Patrol Epsilon. Yeah. And yeah. Some big bastards. Teladini's rapid response. Condor. That must be. Is that like a casino ship? Wouldn't it? Well, I suppose BTNI headquarters. What are you? Yes, and nothing coming up. Arena. Oh. An arena. Um. Yeah, six hundred and sixty-seven thousand. Right. So I need. I need a military place. Um, so I want to find missiles. Boarding, boarding pods are designed to transport boarding parties short distances. To wrong cars fire. Let's go wrong cars fire. Yeah, so one massive thing with this ship is it's got 1,000 cargo space. Um... Which, you know, horrific in my opinion. Entering wrong cars fire. Because what was the um... military outpost? Because the Nemesis was six hundred, although the Spring Blossom is twelve hundred. But yeah, it's only a uh, one of them guys. Actually, technically, need several of those guys, but you know. This production, this laser production complex produces several. This factory. Right. I'm also going to throw a couple of these guns onto Crypt Three. Actually. You know, two seems overkill. But let us successfully dock. I'll hail the family Roncar. The split dynasty honor connection to local trading network right. established. So somewhere over the rainbow. Um Jump Is it here? I have a feeling it might be here. Ten percent. Hang on, did I go into the Treasure's Clouds? Thirty. Forty. So if I did I'm going to make Entering a hit. Farnum's Legend Beta. Okay, so it's not here. Hmm. But I'm feeling it's around here. What it might be well, one thing I do have as well is um this guy's just microchip bot. sitting sitting in a microchip factory that seems to be getting well supplied. And yeah. Entering Bala G's Joy. You are talking to the Chip plants produce So yeah Entering all mounted slots treaty This production complex manufactures special weapons Oh that's our gun Um this you are on? Yeah, you're on. Um. So, for whatever reason, 
in Hattiklar's face. Oh, there's an MX. Um, well, he's friendly with me now. But the um, cattle ship wasn't. So we can get a Marauder. Which is, you know, 111 meters per second, but it's 2,500. With the obvious difficulty of acquiring legitimate corvettes for their own ends. Recent, recent good relations and cooperation between pirate factions has led to the construction of the rare Carrick Light Frigate. In typical pirate fashion, it was built using mainly old or stolen ship parts. Okay. The worst fears of shipping and trading companies were recently realized when the existence nice. of a pirate destroyer was confirmed. Military forces a deadly weapon found on frigates, destroyers, and carriers. Originally used as a beam weapon in laser towers, the plasma beam cannon has now been strengthened and adapted for installation on capital ships. Still not as powerful as the heaviest projectile weapons, it does, however, fire at the speed of light, giving it high accuracy and first strike capabilities. The work Okay. I can remember just someone saying about how they can get ridiculous weapons on every turret. So it's a good alternative to the uh Otas Boreas. Entering Brennan's Triumph. So, yeah, it doesn't seem to be. Maybe it's on the other side. That's Argon. And there's no. Because it's like not far from. You know, the North Gate. I'm wondering if it's now time by Lou Strat's legacy. Yeah, there's an Ogden new beef. Entering Brennan's Triumph Alpha. You are talking to the Pirate Marauder. That's him. Remote guided wildfire banshee boarding pod installed. This corvette sized right. vessel. So he has 600,000. And honestly. Pirate heavy hydra. Hmm. Yeah. Pirate marauder. Oh, come on. Oh, man. Right. Well, we find him. Hmm. Jump device charging at 10%. I was hoping to go a wee bit differently than that, but I suppose it is what it is. So. I 
Let's see if we can lure a Xenon P. These guys are kind of fodder anyway. They're this pair all around. We'll probably not actually succeed. That's if the board and body even lands. Um. Boarding pods are designed to transport boarding parties short distances to enemy ship. Hmm. Yeah. Entering Xenon Sector okay. 101. Well, it's not exactly, you know. The Xenon P I was hoping for. So that's what four Xenon Qs. Xenon J. Xenon J. Yep. There's a Xenon shipyard. There's a P over there somewhere. Um I'm really curious of what's over here though. Having said that, I don't think I'm going to be in a position to outrun them. Alert, missile closing. I'm doing that. Hmm. Alert, missile closing. Well, can I grab him? That's the guy I would have liked. Xenon PX. Hmm. Well, there's a lot of typhoon missile alert missile closing. Holding more accuracy than the firefly, the typhoon missile again allows. Hmm. But imagine they'll self destruct before they reach me, but um, if not. That's nice, it looks like these guys are sort of hanging with their. Hi. So they're just chilling with their, you know, who they're meant to be escort. Um, because. Yeah, he's 224. Oh, now he's closing in. Xeno alert. Missile closing. I wonder if this is going to be a ship. Oh, speaking of which. Um, alert. Diplomacy. Steel equipment. Yeah, you might as well. Um, Terracorp. That one. So I need to gather influence for Terracorp. So I need you to... Well, this will work very well. Um, so I want you to use one. Light. Offer. Command accepted. So then when you get back, you can, you can try and steal that stuff. Um, Xenon L. Alert. Missile closing. Alert. Missile closing. Target left firing range. Xenon, M. Yeah, shit, Target alert, missile closing. Well, he slowed down anyway. Now that he's, you know, damaged. Alert, missile closing. Target is now in firing range. Firestorm, alert. Missile closing. Hmm. 
They cannot be the same missiles. Alert, missile closing. Alert, missile closing. Alert, missile closing. Yeah, that's one thing about mass drivers, they ignore shields. Firestorm torpedo. That's a torpedo. That's not a ah. Look at me turn. We Sun is just under a kilometer. Target is now in firing. Firestorm torpedo. Target is now in firing. Firestorm torpedo. See, this better be something good. Because I just spent so much time. Alert, missile closing. Guarantee it's gonna be a crust fucking crystal thing. Typhoon missile self destructed. Silicon wafer. Really? Typhoon missile self destructed. Ooh. Okay, um. That's okay. The shit we came here. Cargo bay now contains silicon. Right then. See if you fucking feel. I'm gonna be fucking pissed. Typhoon missile self destructed. Cargo bay now contains. Hurricane missile. Firestorm torpedo. Okay, I think it's going to be a good idea to um Firestorm torpedo. Stop trying to outrun torpedoes. And probably Typhoon let's, missile jump design. Let's jump down here and see what the crack is. Um, 20, I did have a 30, ship. There he is. 40, yeah, so he died. Um, my satellite 20, network 80, ship died. 90, he was a Fujin. He is now a Discover Raider because Fujin had more cargo bay. Freedom's reach. But they weren't really filling it with um, satellites. So. You are talking? Do you I shall transmit the data to you. Wasn't really any point to have them. So yeah, so the, it's not a Fujin or not a Fujin. I discover a Raider because it's faster. I have like twenty six meters per second. And yeah, he's um still doing his thing. He's gone into there. Have you been down this neck of the woods? No, you haven't not yet. Hopefully that. Hopefully you go down there next. He did have six satellites. How many does he have? He has three now. So he's probably three. One of them is in the sector I'm in now. Um, okay, anyhow. Got to call the episode there. So thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed my um, fleeing from missiles, then do hit the like button. Subscribe for more. We'll give an effort in the next episode or so to um, get an M6 or two. Very profitable as well if you um, take them over and sell them. But um, yeah, hit the like button if you enjoyed, subscribe for more, and I shall hopefully see you in the next one. Peace.